Hello dear friends, it's Mubarak. Welcome to my channel again. Uh, good afternoon and uh, hope all of you are fine and you have celebrated your Eid in very well. Yes, I'm also in my village home long way from Dhaka city and I have come here to celebrate my Eid. And me too, I have enjoyed a lot seeing the, uh, I have celebrated my Eid with my family, with my friends uh, and I have enjoyed a lot. Yeah, coming here actually, but not only here actually, on Owen, but I was in Dhaka city also, uh, I I got to face uh, some uh, questions even now also I'm facing here and uh, I have been been asked a question uh, frequently about this ready made garments industry you know as I am uh, working in this industry and it is a very big industry so all over the all over the Bangladesh uh, uh, not only the capital city even outside of the capital in district and village because here must people movement I mean involvement here that's why and also as um, uh, maximum percentage for foreign currency i mean uh, we're, we're earning from this industry i uh, you know 83 84 percent so uh, that's why people are also concerned about this industry but somehow uh, you know current uh, rm industry current business a bit slow down and somehow they know because due to solo social media uh, everybody try to keep some knowledge and it seems to me that coming here in even in my village uh, uh, that people have some knowledge about this that's about the current uh, business on uh, ready-made garments it's a bit slow down that's why they're asking me frequently is it slow down and uh, is it threat for us this uh, current slow down and uh, if really uh, I mean is, is, is it risky and if, uh, if uh, this slowdown is really risky uh, so what is the I mean uh, you can say um, uh, uh, they are going to ask that uh, what is the how bad are things are the things going to uh, I mean uh, going to worse even the COVID-2020 are the situation going to exist longer or shortly to be overcome this sort of questions actually I am getting so yes truly um, I agree with them uh, recently we are also facing some problem because we are not uh, we are also facing that yes a bit slow down here we are not getting that mass volume order uh especially last last um, three or four months but yes we are hoping uh, this uh, situation situation would not longer so much i mean so long um, and uh, from some different statistics and from my own view i think uh, this situation situation come over very soon and till then we have to work very hard and we have to try to turn this challenge into opportunity now actually i would like to share some uh, um, view or some statistics why this slowdown and why you are not supposed to be old this slowdown because you know all all of we all of know actually we all know that uh, we have been facing two major tran uh, transition periods what the transition period? two major transition transition period now number one two zero two zero two zero two zero covid pandemic and this you know that the major economic impact happened all over the world in 2000 uh, 2020 whenever the COVID pandemic pandemic started then somehow on 2021 we uh, our arms industry again uh, tried to I mean get back because that time we got the more order and uh, we got money this industry got back but again another transition period that is 2022 24 February the Russia Ukraine war started and you know this war carries a disaster all over the world again and you know the global economics global economics turned down rapidly and global you can say global economic um, economics started bleeding actually and um, uh, due to this ongoing russia ukraine war so this war actually um, we, we, we were facing still now problem for this or russia ukraine war because they were leads to causing the high inflation as well as the energy and power cost acceleration especially in the euro market and you know due to this uh, high inflation and uh, increased of price of energy all energy means you know my fuel then power then gas customers have problem actually to buy their regular needs they're trying to face the regular needs they're trying to, trying to survive so they got uh, a bit slow down of buying uh, of buying apparel so they change their buying pattern and they're trying to uh, buy the daily needs and uh, that's why that's actually the um, apparel industry bit slow down because uh, customers are not buying that much 
and uh, the brands sir uh, brands have uh, i mean uh, somehow the brand uh, missed the season to sell out the goods and that's why their inventory pay piled up and uh, also um, brand are not buying that uh, that way in volume way they are also observing the market that's why actually uh, but yes uh, uh, that's why the reason uh, you know we have, we have uh, getting a bit less order less order now but we hope our hope is uh, we hope this crisis moment would be uh, over and must the customer would come back uh, with this full phrase again